this is our project number pick 114 and when we switch on we first find that there is the gsm testing we can see the reading here gsm testing and after the gsm testing is over the testing gsm module and then it is waiting for a message now if we send any message to this number there is a gsm modem here and there is a sim card attached here and then we have the controller and then the loads are here these are the loads this is of course is a load for which we would like to take the uh, reading through this meter and the, we have interfaced from the meter to the point here so that the pulses of the meter are given to the microcontroller for getting the reading exact as to how much is the energy consumed now we would like to send a message based on the message the loads will be switched on so we are now trying to send a message from this mobile number now supposing i send a message from this mobile number as uh, uh, we have to send the for one for load one uh, which will be switched on and two for uh, two like that now so supposing i press one and i say send and the sending message is uh, going to uh, maybe uh, what we have uh, stored is uh, that is the uh, number that we have to feed okay gsm test number and then uh, we select okay and then we say send once we say send that message is gone and once that message goes we find that the load which will be um, uh, we have sent a message that the, now the load one is switched on and if you would like to get the confirmation over that so what we can do is uh, we can uh, we can go over and then uh, send a uh, we would like to know how many loads are switched on and switched off based on which we will get the confirmation for the confirmation what we have to do is we have to go and then send a capital s now we send a capital s s and send to again we send the the number as uh, the same gsm test okay g s m test number and we are sending to this number and then now the message is sent after the message is sent we will receive the confirmation because we have given this number so we will now we find there is a message which is received here and uh, we will get that message from here we have received the message here so we get here the status report the status report says that uh, load 1 is on and uh, load 2 3 4 are off this is what is how we get the confirmation and as regards the uh, the power which is consumed is also will be automatically conveyed based on this particular load it will be automatically conveyed if you would like to check uh, since we can't wait for a longer duration we can check it for checking whether the uh, electric uh, billing is sent or not so what we can do we have removed the ic from here there was uh, the opto isolator and the, this is pin number 4 and this is pin number 5 we just go on sorting them for some time and then we find that it has already sent some message and that message is that's the units and the rupees we will get that message and uh, we will see exactly that this is uh, indicating a rupee of yes the message has now reached uh, it is uh, 0.13125 is the uh, amount we will see that in the new message see now the message that we received is this exactly whatever was the reading we have got the same reading here what we can see can see we have got the same reading which is there in the lcd thank you